Hey, hope you're doing well. RJ here, back again with another training lesson in Microvellum Toolbox. So when I was working in the shop and trying to get things out to production, uh, we had a system set up where a certain material was going to go out to the CNC machine that needed some different settings compared to just our stock material. So like, for example, our pre-lamp needed to have some specific settings and our melamine needed to have something completely different. So this video, we're going to go through the process on how we can work with our processing stations to set up some of those different properties. Different nest settings can be used for specific materials. So I'm going to show you one way that we could set that up. Opening up our toolbox setup, and now into the options and the processing stations. So what I'm going to do is just create a separate processing station and then change those nest settings. And then when we assign our parts in the processing center, we just want to make sure that PLAM is going to one and our melamine is going to the other. I'm just going to give this a new name. And all those settings are the same as the other processing station. So now we got a unique name. We'll go back in there, make an edit to the nest settings. So now we're going to want to make this one smallest X. Anything else you wanted to change in here, you can do that. And like I said, it's just a matter of going into the processing center once we get all this loaded up and assign that station to those selected parts. So we can do it this way. Assign that station, make sure everything else is under just our standard default nest. You can also load this list by the material. That makes it easier. Just keep in mind that the melamine that's been assigned to a processing station still has that processing station assigned to it. It didn't remove that. Now that's a way that you can set up your processing stations to send specific material out to the shop with those nest settings that you want. So that's all for this one. Be sure to check out some of our other work order videos and working in the processing center. Until next time, I'm RJ, and thanks for watching.